Ah, we begin, so the camera goes dark. So you can't see me and I can't see you. So there's some kind of adjustment we have to make. So we'll give a hit of the camera. This, this, this. What do you think it is? I have no idea. I show them no light. And then there's light. Ah! <laughs> This wasn't in my mouth. Weren't you watching all the time? This wasn't in my mouth. This was in my mouth. Well, that's the difference. As long as what comes out of my mouth is not so bad. Because the smoke we blow out of our mouth, you know what? The reason they stop us from banning us from smoking in buildings, it's not for this, okay? Because it's worse inside the tunnel. It's worse inside the metro. Don't you smell it in the metro? You barely smell this. It's what's inside of this that comes out of your mouth from the big head we have. It's who we are that comes out in the air. It's hot air. How do we live? I mean, I'm not a scientist or anything, and that's why I came on here, because I had a million and one questions. And every time I go down to the school, I mean, oh my God, you're talking about that. I don't want to know about that. I mean, aren't you a teacher? Teach me. I want to know. Are you ready for this session? Why am I wearing this? So anyways, we're going to get back to what I was stalking on the last cassette. So for those of you who have missed it, you're going to have to go back to my last two, which is a follow-up. So what happens over here? The reason I'm wearing this is because if I, when I take it off, oh my God, it's terrible. I'll keep it on. I feel the vibrations coming out of me, and it's vibrating around my head, and it makes me feel good. I like it. That's why you go down and they sell you a bracelet. Put on the bracelet. It's going to make you feel good. But you're, if you're a piece of it ain't going to make you feel good. Or if you're confused, because the process we're going through here and what we're actually doing on Earth is all in the mind. We go to the psychiatry, and they treat us, and they tell us. And my son was reading about it. He says, Dad, it's in your mind. He says, don't you get it? I said, that's the thing. I can't get it. I says, help me. He says, you're not at peace inside your mind. And then my ex-wife says, you're not at peace. And everybody's telling me I'm not at peace because I've been pushed to last all my life. So I, I said, you know what, last is first because I go to the bottom and I see what it's like. And it's quiet. It's a little cold, a little dark, but I'm a fish. So what's the difference? I'm in the school of Yo or Yu-Gi-Oh. Yo and craps. Y, O, the Y is the 25th letter. The O is the 15th. It counts for the 40. It's Yo Alev. Now you got 51, area 51. The one dice in the five position. You got area 51 with yo, 11. But you don't have that. You end up getting 11. Because the one position on the other side is a six. So once you have the yo, 11, it's no longer the one because that's the spirit. You have the spirit inside the man, which makes it a six. So you now have five, six, 11. You have a Lenin. And you're playing the game of craps. And the payout in that game is exactly what it is because it's all about creation. And everybody's got to take a vig. If you don't take a vig, the center cracks. You got to support the center as much as you got to support the sides. If you take one everybody's money, one side falls, and the center actually is in no use anymore. So then, these things I marked on my head. Let me take this off. Right now that they're all smudged, is this one here? You see the way it makes this? This you see the loop it makes? Okay, and then it goes up. It's a bird's eye. Don't you see the, the Indians do it? How do you think I, do you think I just marked my head like this? I started reading about Indian 28 days. I started thinking about Lenin. They used to put a feather on their hat. Yankee Doodle came to town. You put the pin the tail on the donkey. The club card in the, has, a, has a thing in his hat. And the heart has one also. And the spade has one eye because he's the body of the man and he has the other eye. Or unless the spade is the evil eye. And that's why he's the nav, because that's what he got as a job, because in the last world, that was, that's what he was good at. But he was so good at it, he was so good at it, that he had a chance to come back and make up in the mind of another, to show them the deepest and darkest stories, so that they can come between the two balls, and then together at the end of the life, go up, whoosh, down to the back of our neck, but on the way to the neck, Jesus was in the picture, okay, what was it, the Last Supper, the Da Vinci Last Supper, where he's leaning over like this, because your one spirit is the spirit in the ear, the spirit in the sky. It's your highest, it's the highest thing on you. It's your sky. The ears are your sky, the sky of your eye. And that's why they all rhyme. God put it together to rhyme, didn't he? Well, who am I to say? It's the way I see it. So anyways, in order for these two to go together, 
the passage in the center, which is you, which makes all the decisions in life, okay, at the end of it, where an I is a verb and instead of the name of who we are is a noun, okay, and you make all those decisions. So whatever happens to those balls after, okay, you're inside of them. They become you. They were only a loner, like a video game. They were a loner to you. You know, he can go as strong as he wants, you know, but he dies at the end because you're not as good in the game as you're supposed to be. So what happens to these two balls, okay, is wherever they're actually located somewhere else, they must play a balancing act. Even good and evil, they must always come in the center, and this side and this side can never win. The end result is your action here. And that's why when you take your hand, right, and you put it on your head here, oh my God, and you drag it, the center finger is on your nose. And it's the middle finger, and that's where it belongs. These two fingers go in your eyes, okay? Your thumb, and this, these are your cheeks, okay? Right where your mustache is, okay? So Movember might be a little bit deeper into communication, which is a pro-state or a protest of a state. The body is protesting something, and that's what happened. So what did you do in your life? What did somebody do before you in their life? Is it frustration? Is it aggravation? Did we lie? Or does God need us to do a job higher up and somewhere else? And we've done so good that, you know what, it's time to go. And you've got to go anyways one day. So that's the way he looks at it. But, okay, God can't look at it as the middle. He has to say, you got overtime, my friend. I think we have overtime. The minute we hit 41, it's into overtime. Because when I hit 41, I was way out of time. Whoa, baby, I was hot. But I wasn't as good as I think I am today. It's good to think you're good at something. I'm good at something. I talk to myself. What's happening, man? Who's there? Nobody. I don't see you. You don't see me. You see who's in the background tonight? Time has stood still. All night. This night, time must stand still. Nine days after 11 is a pregnancy. Okay? This time must stand still until the 22nd. The eve of the 21st. On the 22nd, okay, it's actually the equality of two and two. Two and two. 22nd word, letter in the alphabet in the French, they say it's a life. It's a V. It's a life on a stand. Because, I mean, look, here's a V, right? And it's on a stand. Here's the, here's the stand and here's the rabbit ears. That's the V. That's the Y. This way or that way. Which way? Between my eyes, behind my eyes. One of my friends always has a problem behind his eyes. Well, of course. If you're always tricking yourself to feel good, eventually the feel good is going to trick you. It's got to, it's, the ball goes rolling and what, it, it rolls and it just keeps going and it's constantly adjusting itself, constantly, but you're always going up. And as you go up, oh my God, there's a hole. It drops back to the next level and you start to go up again and you run into the hole because your adjustment speed is the same thing as when the people go drifting with their car. You have to stay up along the wall okay in between the two walls on that angle to make it up I'm not sure if it's a 45 degree angle or what the angle is but um, all the angles of the rain and anything that goes on is always 40 I have to I just want to go at 45 because they don't use it in tennis and 45 and 45 you make it up to the top and down to the bottom out to the left and out to the right so 45 is actually reserved and 45 is actually 4 5 on your telephone but if the angels talking or the man's talking okay it goes 4 5 4 as one expression. If you want to see it in another expression, it's four, five, six in order. Four, five, six in order is 15. And on the telephone, okay, there's more than one way to get 15. Okay, the first row is one, two, three equals six. Or let's multiply it instead. One times two times three is six. Both ways, one, two, three creation, make a six man. And that's the number we are. We're six away from Pluto. Do we get sent to Saturn after? No, I think our communication is between Saturn and Mars. Saturn, okay, has the rings on it. I think the bad, that bad angels must be living there. Man six, the opposite of man six, because man six is supposed to be good, would be Saturn. And four would be Mars, because four and six are across from the telephone, and they make up of the egg. So that's the makeup of who we are. So if you study these two planets, which is Saturn and Mars, and uh, what's very funny about that is that uh, Mar uh, uh, Mars has two, planet, uh, two, uh, two moons, and... Mars and SARS and a Mars bar and the Nougat and the, and the Milky Way in there and everything, you know. And the 63 moons which are sitting on uh, Jupiter, on uh, Jupiter, which is the king of all, I call that the star of Bethlehem. Did I ever tell you that story? 
doesn't matter if I don't get back to it. It's up to you. If you want to hear something that I missed, you're going to have to remind me because if I change a story, I'm just changing the story. Did I finish with this? So I'm going to remember this after. So I don't remember what I was going to say, but I'm going to say something anyways. Um, the second row is 4, 5, and 6, and that equals 15. It means a one spirit of 5. Okay, Man is actually 3. His creation is 3 and 3, which makes him 6. But he's on earth and he's 3. But he has to live in the 5 hole. He has to live right in the middle between 4 and 6 to know what's going on because the messages go back and forth. So man is actually on Jupiter, the star of Jupiter. And that reminds me of what the story is, was two, two Jewish men. But they weren't Jewish at all. They became Jewish once they made the wish. But the other guy, well, he was ready for war. He looked at it as war. He was a germination guy because he planted things. Well, the other guy was just, you know, a cuckoo guy looking in the sky. But they were buddies. And they were fun. So they went out to the star one night, and they look up into the sky. And one guy says, my friend, my friend, look, gems. Look at all the gem. Wow, gemida. The other guy says, no, no, no. It looks more like a jewel, like a jewel of the Nile of some sort. He goes, no. He says, it's a gem. He says, no, it's a jewel. And he hits him in the eye. One guy says he's sorry. The other guy runs home and he's pissed off and he looks at his wife. He says, he, hey, you know what? He says, I'm the one about life. He says, I'm the V, okay? I'm the WV because I'm the fox. I'm in Germany. And I saw a star tonight. It was so beautiful. It was full of gems. What do we call it? Because we have to make a wish. So the German fella, oh, is he German? Well, he found a German star, a gem star, a germination star, a, the star of Bethlehem that germinated Mary and gave the birth of Jesus Christ. On the same night, the Jew, he saw the star, comes home to his wife. His wife says, what's wrong? And he's, only, he's looking at her with only one eye because obviously he doesn't have a wife. He's God. And if you look at the King of Diamonds, the King of Diamonds only has one eye because he got smacked out by the other guy. But it's not his fault. He was probably a club, the other guy. Hit him with a club because God's the spade, but his son got spaded, and that's why he's the nav because he has to act like the mean one. So these kings are all intertwined inside our own minds. So he says to his wife, he says, what do we do? What do we do? Oi, 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 we make a wish. So what do we wish? Let's wish upon the jewel star. We'll call it a jewel wish star, a Jewish star. And the two guys met on the hill the next night. He says, so what got, went on? What did you say to your wife? She says, well, I like, I like a lot of gems. Perfect, we'll call it Gemini. Maybe we'll call it Germany or Jiminy Crickets and Geppetto. And Geppetto is a word of a fag. And they call him the nav. And the nav is now a fag because he, okay, is the position five for you to go through with your mind. So he has to be that nav. Six has to go through five to get to four. I know we're five and in the center, but don't forget there's uh, elevated worlds. Okay, on your phone it shows you an extra row. That ain't for nothing. The star key is explaining one, four, and seven. It means the one spirit of the four corners of the seven, which means the center one five of the one four seven of the three six nine, totaling seven. The other way from the heavens, it's the one two three with the five center with seven eight nine nougat talk 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 topped on top. <laughs> so I'm gonna have a little orange juice. So. Um, Yeah, so Geppetto was a fag, and then they came up with a pedal boat. One, one goes in, one comes out. One goes in, one comes out. Geppetto, the fag, the nav, the pedal boat, on the water. The water is like the O, and he's like in an O because it's not sinking. So you got two waters in one, just like when you give birth, the child, the sack, is it actually in a water? because it's lubricated, otherwise it would crack the sack. Hack and sack. Hack and back. I'm getting a cigarette out of my bag. You don't mind? Well, I think I'm getting a cigarette out of my bag. I put everything in a bag. I got four different compartments. 
okay, in which two of them are for licenses, okay, and no credit cards. Because unless my credit card can turn color when I spend money, I don't want a credit card. In fact, I don't want any credit. Because if I don't have the money today, how can I have it tomorrow? You're supposed to budget on yesterday, not tomorrow. Whatever you have now, it doesn't matter what you have now, it's what you had yesterday. And if you have too much, you better start giving it away. Because the balls over here uh, don't put up with this. When the system is built, it's built by the mind of a great one, a creator. And he builds a machine to think for him because he can't be in everybody else's mind. So he implements his own blood into every body that's ever born. Okay? He puts it in a machine and they call it the thought adjusters. Okay? And they go on both sides of your brain and you make the decision. That machine will put you automatically where you should be because of what you chose. You see, the fingers on uh, in this planet is we need the people all the time. He doesn't have the fingers on to make those last minute decisions, the snap of the finger that he can't do from up there. Even if he could, he's one down here. We have to teach ourselves among ourselves. That's why we must be friends. And if you want to know why I talk pressured all the time, because it comes in pressured. If I slow down, then I'm not, I just don't get the impulse as well, because it's clogging up and waiting for me to say it. It's all waiting in line. Hold on, guys. Whoa, they're all in the back of my head. I feel them moving up. Whoa. Slide on by, eh? Slide on over. Moving on over. So the system, okay, is the one that judges. You're in the house of God. It's like hooking up. You move into a parking lot. That's your space. You either pay for it or you don't. But if you don't move it one day and you don't pay for something and the lot gets sold, you lose your house. So God hooks up with Urantia, which is the power of Christ. And it's yellow power, okay, which actually has to do with things people don't like to talk about. It's when you take care of a child and all that stuff comes out. Well, that's what it is. It's the same thing. It's a, it's, a, it's a tar pit. And the tar that comes out of us, okay, the tar that comes out of us is the black energy of what we went through in our lives. And it reads it all. And then it knows how to bat battle the two sides because it needs you even and it needs to correct you. Because if you keep going down the wrong road, okay, Urantia is going to choose where you go next. And you don't want Urantia to choose because they start at the bottom. But don't worry about it. You'll like the heat. But it's work anyways. And you don't have to work all year because sometimes you go up north and you freeze in the winter time and you just sleep for six months like a bear. So what were you doing in this life? The Indians, you think they didn't know? The Indians know. Like I said, if you are an Indian out there and you want to go and make a powwow and something outside, I don't want to sit in somebody's house. You see what it looks like in my house? This is what I want. I want a colorful zoo. We came into this world. God gave us all these colors to, to fool around with. And... Um, now I'm looking for something and... Oh yeah, here it is. And I just picked up a card from the floor which I'm going to read. I've never done this before. This is all new for me. I do it off. I don't practice. I, I don't come in. It's all live. You see it streamed. It's the first time. I'm not correcting myself. If I want to, I will. If I don't, if I make a mistake, that's fine. The next time you'll hear it different, you'll know because I made a mistake some way, somehow. Okay. I bought this. Okay. And they're soaps. And when it went in here, okay, on the right side is the purple soap. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, there's seven. And the purple soap represents the birth, okay? And that's uh, because you have the purple ball, the purple ball, the uh, purple horse, uh, that's nine, the number nine horse, and nine stands for birth. And in pull, I think it's the four and 12, and they're both purple, and that is the birth of the four corners of God, A, B, C, D, Aleph, Bet, Gimel, Dalet, Okay, A, B, C, D, but in all actuality, sometimes they rather say it Aleph, Gimel, hold on a second, hold on a second, yeah, they would say it, um, now there's many ways to say it, Aleph, Vet, Dalet, Vav. Because we jumped over the bet. Okay? We're talking about the odd numbers of gods. So if we're talking about odd numbers, we have to use the whole board. And you have to skip. One, three, five. Dalit. Okay? The pink. That means the opening. This is the passage. Number five. One, two, three, four, five. The passage. For the gimel is creation. 
So there's something missing in here. I'm, how am I reading it? He is the stable for man. And Vav is man. So this is Zion, which is the world of God or the, or the, uh, the house of the creator. So Chet, okay, is actually the house, it's, the living house itself, the living house of God himself. What would that be? Let's, let's go in the regular order. Uh, Aleph, Bet, Gimel is three. Dalit is four. He is five. Vav is six. Zion is seven. Chet would be the heaven. Tet would be the birth. And Yod would be the tenth one, would be the explanation of angel and man. Then you have calf over here, which is the eleventh. Okay, and that's the calf, the sacrifice calf, because that's the, the energy of life that comes into us. They represent the angel inside your mind, which gives you the mind to think. That's why we have the mind, the mind, my mind, my and, the same thing. So, yeah, I'm pretty good. Is it upside down or inside out? So where are we next? So uh, we did the calf, and the shaft, right, is, is the passage, right, or the system, but it, there's no, nothing inside of it. So one is the good, which is the calf, and the other one is the shaft. Then they have the final shaft, which is you, which is in the center, which is, par which is an extended dalit, which is explaining the four and six angel inside your mind, because I always thought we were four and six, and no, we're, we're actually three and two because we're part of creation, which makes us five. And how do we get the six out of that? Well, three and two, which is beta creation, which is uh, Aleph, uh, Bet, Gimel, um, which would be two times three, which would be six Vav, two plus three, which would be one, two, three, four, which would be He. So He and Vav would actually be uh, six, and uh, you would say Dalit Aleph, but you can't put Dalit and Aleph together in this situation, so I'd have to say He and Vav. One, two, three, four, five. He and Vav would make the eleven part of man. And then if you split the alphabet up, um, I, I never really worked on this one, but the Shin and the Sin, right? The Shin and the Sin, the green life and pink, you're the, the, you're the, the, shi, the Shin and the angel inside of you is the Sin, okay? The Tav, Okay, if you want to know what the tab is, I've been working on something. Where's my papers? Fall this, drop that, lose this, lose that. Okay, where's the papers? There's people waiting here. Ah, finding of the papers. Ah, finding of the papers. Let me see. So I, I'm picking them up off the floor, picking this up off the floor, and this up off the floor. If you don't mind, just, just bear with me a little bit. It's not that easy. It's not that easy. Okay, so I got. I was starting with this, and the next one, okay, is the orange sun, the pink pig, the green life, the Mediterranean, the red spirit, and yellow man. Starts off with your birth and tells you who you are at the end on the soap thing here. Bubbles, bath, B and B, 22nd letter, meaning life, okay, or two and two is four, which means the angle, or the letter D, or Dalit, and then when it says in French, bamous, because it's bubbles, and it's bubbles who, that are inside us that make the elements work, because without the bubbles, everything tightens up, and there's no passage, you can't breathe, and you're all gone. So B and M, right, is 2 and 13, which says 15, and that's the egg, because 1 and 5 is 6, again. Because you always have to bring it down to one number, because the number is the expression at the end, okay? But what's in between the expression, I'll say, go outside! But what am I going outside to do? I need to know the inside. You're telling me about the outside, but what about the inside of what you're telling me to do to go on the outside? You're just telling me to go out. And I don't want to go out at all. I'm going nowhere. Okay, so we have this. Now, I did this on one of my tapes, and I think it broke. You see this? It doesn't look like much, right? Well, when you start folding it up, right, and you hold it this way, let's see. Looks like a guy who's screaming like hell. See the jack? He has a jack to help him. Here's the black oil. That's all his thinking. His saliva is coming out, and that's his thinking. Here is a loop in his tongue. This is his tongue, but it's a loop inside. You have to take into account every effect. Okay? So now what you do, you take it, you put it... What you saw is one man, right? But he's a thinking man, because look what's up in the corner. It's a bird. It's a bird, it's a man, it's Superman. So you fold it up, okay, and then you turn it on this side. 
and it's a bird. But if you turn it upside down on this side, okay, there's a swan on the top and a bird on the bottom and the eye, okay, is in between the neck of the swan. You see, in between the neck of the swan and she makes the S and the five and that black mark going in, well, that's what holds it, okay? These two balls in here are like this. And no matter what you do, it's all up to you because it's in a machine. God's here helping us. The passage is inside a machine. Just like I'm talking to you and you're talking to me. How do you want him to do it? What are you going to... Hey, man, I'm coming over. Hey, guys, God's coming over. Yeah, is he going to create anything today? Yeah, he's taking the weeds out of his garden so he can lift our mind a little bit. The tomatoes, the potatoes... The pomp, la mousse, pomp, pom, apple, an apple and a moose. What an apple doing in a moose? Because the moose is in New York, New York City. The apple and the moose is in New York City. But what about the bear and the bull? Oh, don't you worry about the bear and the bull. Because the moose, the moose, okay, he is a bull. A male moose is a bull, okay. So when you have this in your New York City, that bull, those antennas, okay, on that bull, okay, are very dangerous, a lot more dangerous than the pointed arrows you have on a Toro bull. Those are antlers. In the middle of antlers, if you look at the Canadian quarter, it says 25, that is passage. Two and five is the seven of the seven islands. Two times five is 10, which tells you four and six or any one of the other cross corners, which one you're talking about. So what you have is two times five, it's 10. 2 and 5 is 7. 17, stand. But let's look at it a different way. Let's split it. 10 is the jack, and 7 is the G. You 17 stand? 10 and 7, the French. Say G for J and J for G. And it works out perfectly. We're going to stop this cassette on what we saw, just in case uh, it shuts down on me. I'm not taking any chances. It's been going a lot better. I hope you all appreciate it. And it's not for me alone. It's for us because the ball in my head will tilt a certain way depending on what he did because all our stuff goes into the system because we all react in this system. So it all comes back to you what anybody does. If my neighbor's really bad, there's a chance I'm in trouble because if I'm too good and he's too bad, they're going to counter out on me. And you've got to start really thinking in your head. And then all of a sudden, because of who you are in your life, you end up with a mental disorder because you can't position yourself yourself. And it took the other guy next door who you didn't know what he did, and he fixed you. Because it's in the mind, it's the balance of the balls. It's up and down, it's like a brakes. If you ever go to a truck, there are, there are brakes, the air brakes, okay? There's a little S inside and it turns this way and this way. When you release it, it goes this way. There's a pressure on it, okay, on that brake. One has more pressure than the in, one is the pressure in, one is the pressure out. That's our blood pressure. That's because of the balls. We must come together. A thousand churches were created because God needed gangs. And you're not allowed gangs anymore in this world. So create a church. He figured if there's only few, if we can now connect the churches online, like Facebook and YouTube, then we can get together and the understanding will start to come out and life will prevail and the conscious change coming in 2016 will be good. I'm, give, I'm not going to be like the way I'm telling the story. I'm telling you the last day. I'm not telling you the first day. It's not my business the first day. Because my book ends. My book ends in July 4th, 2016. Right? But because the first birth went by, it will no longer be July 4th. It will be July 13th the next time we celebrate Independence Day. And everything clicks in my family. Because on that day, July 13th of 2016, my brother becomes the age of passage, which automatically opens the door for me because he was in my family and I reacted off of him the same way he reacted off of me and the rest of our entourage around us. So when he's 53, I'm going to be 51. And I am Area 51 on that date. In fact, all my dates since this whole project began have been falling exactly in the hole because November 11th, 2011, for me, was the beginning of the book. Six years, six months, six days. 
May 5th, 2005, I began this. And I said, I'm going to find something. And no matter what I find, I'm not going to be an Indian giver. I'm going to be an Indian. And I'm going to give whatever I know for nothing. Up until a certain point where I must take what everybody is taking and take what people think I'm worth and give it back to straighten out this entire world. Because if you think you take oil out of the ground of Texas with those Colorado mountains, okay, and all that traffic going on, how come the mountain doesn't fall down? And that's just something on top of my mind. That's in another chapter in my book that I'm thinking of. Why doesn't the Rocky Mountains fall down with all those Gushers and Montana? Just that, that whole entourage, just very interesting. The minute you pass Kansas City, I mean, you got to pass the Cardinal first. First, the Cardinal Rule. Don't forget about the Cardinal Rule, okay? The Cardinal Rule is Missouri because they have the St. Louis Cardinals. And he's more red than any other bird I've ever seen before. Every baseball team, hockey team, football team, soccer team, Mahjong game, casino game, the cars, the colors, the pedals, the carpets, Canadian tire, the way they put their shelves, the telephones, everything comes from an order of justice. Because the justice is here. And we take our balls with us wherever we go. Because if we don't, we'll never be balanced. We always must be in Trinity. The three triangles, okay? All these pyramids that they build, the Red Sea, the Dead Sea, connecting red to dead is black to red. It's a revitalization of life. It opens a door in Aquarius, an aquarium. You come in with Aries, you start with the air, you finish with the water. So it has to go out in Aquarius, and Jesus is known to be the fish. And we're all the fish in the lake. But the fish is not so bad. Because if he's in a lake, he can see a worm. And when he sees a worm, it's on a hook. And the hook is like a jack, and he says, I'm going to jack myself right out of here. I don't care if I die. I was a good boy. I just asked to be a fish for a little bit. And now I'm going out. So he has a free departure from the lake. But if he wanted to be a fish and he wasn't good and he thought he was good and he misjudged himself, well, that fish might stay in that lake a long time. And it gets dark really early around the trees. But it's okay. He sees a beaver dam, so he figured he can lay it up right there, and then his life was gone anyways because the beaver had another thing in his mind. And the beaver is on our nickel. And the penny is the leaf. It's the Yankee Doodle dandy leaf accompanied with the nickel that makes the six man. If you add up your change, one of each, you have 41 cents, which is the Mediterranean. If you take three quarters, because we are three quarters, we have to be three reindeer to make the passage for the two angels and us is three. And you take the three quarters, you take a dime, you got 85 cents. You take a nickel, you got 90 cents. You take one more penny, you got 91 days. You got 91 days of what? Is that fall? 91 is the spirit number. If you count the cards from 1 to 13 in the deck, they add up to 91. If you multiply it by the four suits, you get 364. But we must count each suit. So we count each suit as a quarter. So then we have the 365 days. But what about the 366? Well, don't you look at the diamonds and how diamonds work? Because diamonds are forever. i show you a diamond somewhere. Here's a diamond. They have four sides on it. They have more than one life. That six card, okay, if you can sh see it, it's one, three, four, six, one, three. That's the combination because it's on a different level, okay? This is more than one house. So if you add them together, okay, if you see, oh, let me turn the card over the other way because I marked it the other way. So it shows 20, okay, because we go to the center. We're only counting the center. This card must be counted all the way to the bottom because of the triangles. They show you you can count both ways, both sides. But the primary count of just counting the top is one and three, four, four and six, 14. It creates the passage between the four and six. Plus the four is 18, chai. Okay, now let's count it just one, three, four, six, seven, nine, because you can do it this way. The seven, nine is in the lower world. Okay, if you flip it up the other way, it's inside God's world, but now I'm going to go into the other world. I have to play like this because this is, this is a five-liner or a six-liner, and the telephone only has four. Okay, the worlds move up and down. Okay, they have to. We're in a parking lot. We only get a passage in here. We can't let any of the bad stuff get out into the universe because eventually, okay, our brains are stronger than the universe, and we can screw everything up if we get out there. But you know what? When we're all done... 
just to make everything feel good. They throw them in the Arctic. They freeze them over for 10,000 years. Hell freezes over. The Arctic breaks loose. The Titanic is 100 years. November 11, 11, 11 came around. 235 years since the independent the United States. But don't remember the 17, the 16 year I told you, 2016. For what happened from 2000 to 216? What happened? How come it didn't happen? How come it didn't happen in 2000? Well, the same thing. Take away or add 16 years to 1776 before it began there. It actually began in 1792. 1792 to 2014 is 222 years. To 2016 is 226 years, which is actually 22.6, which is the birth of a new life on this planet. So this card, okay, Six, you see the six in one corner and the six in the other corner? You know what that says? That says all diamonds are worth six each. You have six of them. This card has a value of 36. Two 18s, one on this side, one on this side. High. That's the way she works. And time stands still. Time actually hasn't really moved, okay? But it will move soon because the balls of the bulls and the bear they don't want to stay in the same place because Rocky and Bullwinkle are coming to town and one stores nuts and the other one distributes it. Rocky and Bullwinkle. Um, so what I was going to do is now I did this in a couple of videos before. Okay. Now what this is, uh, not this side, but in blue, that's the wolf. That's, that's the Mayan count of 25,625. Makes that V-like shape. Okay, it's a V. It's also a double V. It means Volkswagen. Okay, it's the totality of the time of man, VW. There it is. Now, on the bottom part, right, uh, how can I hold this? You see, there's one missing. Where did it go? Let me see if you can see this. Uh, well, you don't see the number, eh? Well, the first number where, my, where this finger is, that's seven. Well, you see the next one is 8, 7, 8. Now, what happened to 9? 7, 8, 9. And then you have a foot of God right there holding up your, your one foot. You see it here? This one is sitting on top of God's foot. It's a triangular. You see the way I pass through on... Let me see. Does it work out? Well, this way... Okay, you see, this foot here, this is sitting on it. It's a sideways triangle here. But if I put the legs back on it, it turns into an ace. So this, sh this foot lifts this foot with the eight right there. And that's the connection. One, four, seven. I took out the one because the one doesn't exist on the phone. So all you're left with in three numbers are four, seven, and eight, which is the 19. And that 19 equals to spirit. And 319 equals to Heinz 57. And then you take a six of man, you put it on that, and you got 63 moons on Jupiter. This has been a very good session. Not as good as the first session that got canceled out. But this has been quite well. So I have this on my head, okay? Did, did we finish with this? So these balls are automatic in your head. You're split here. Like I showed everybody, you pull your hand, and your finger is like, this is no, your nose. Your nose judges from between everything. When you're thinking like this, oi, 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 oi. When you do, oh, yeah, 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 it shakes you up. It says, oh, let me think, let me think, let me think. We're here to think. We're thinkers. We're here to work because we need to eat. And we need to eat and need to work because we need to think. And we can't think all the time because our balls will get so tight and screw us all up. So we always got to keep the balls loose. And that's why we play golf because we get to hit anything out of us. And we hit the ball in the air and it goes and it goes. And you pick up that ball. And because the ball went high, high, high in the air, whatever was in the air is now pit put right into your hand because you picked that ball up. It touched all that information up there. So it's good. When you golf and you have fun and you pick up that ball, you'll get a good vibe and you'll send that vibe right up to the chemtrails. And those chemtrails will take it right on down. So when you play golf, try to learn that it doesn't matter if you hit it left or right. It's okay to get frustrated, but don't get mad at anybody else. And if you want to live in your own frustration and you don't want to straighten yourself out, it's all up to you. This is a book. Do you know how many pages I would have if I have to start writing down this book right now? Because I'm going to be looking for somebody to take all my stuff together and put one story together. That's why I'm doing it this way. I've been writing for years, but I don't have fifty, sixty thousand dollars to put it together. I need someone who can see the whole act with the eyes and the nose and the hat. 
Oy, oy, oy. Honey, we're rich. Silver. Hi-ho, silver. The energies of the silver hat. All those who are my friends became my friends, that might be my friends that are thinking my friends. Whoever gave me a chance to come up here and to let out the steam that I have to let out, well, thank you very much, because letting out steam lifts the balls in your head, and that's what you want. You want light balls, so we want ping pong balls, because the ping pong balls draw the right number, and it's pretty simple. Next time you watch a lottery draw, it's all balls, and there's popping up there, and popping up there, and popping up there, until the right one comes down and comes into you to make a correction. So the lottery is making corrections and telling us of what's going on in life. But I don't want to pick up a lottery ticket and look at it, okay, because I don't want to see. I don't want to see. I don't want to see the luck of the draw, because it's the luck of the draw. That's all it is. It's the luck of the draw, because if something is actually heavy, most of the time it's no good. And all the good stuff don't fall down. So if you start seeing all the evil, start playing evil numbers. But then everything is confusing. This one's in Canada. So you got to make sure you stick only in Canada. Now, is it only in Quebec? And what's the percentage of the population in Quebec compared to everywhere else where the lottery was picked? So you mark that all down and you put it in a machine and you write down whatever else you want to do and then boom, you win the lottery. But what, what good is that? We're only here for like 50 to 80 years. And winning a lottery, if we're not nice people, or if we're nice but we just can't really figure anything out and we're not treating anything properly inside of ourselves, besides on the outside of ourselves, then what good is the lottery? The lottery is good, but it's no good if you don't know how to use it, regardless of how much money it is. I guarantee you one thing, I get $50 million, I don't have that $50 million for too long. It doesn't mean I'm not going to keep it because we all need a nest egg. You've got to build it up at the beginning, make a nice egg, and then you can distribute the rest. It's putting some water in the lake. We put the few fish, but if you don't put any more water, well, all the fish are going to swim in schools. And that's the way it is in this life. We are schooling ourselves forever. And if you ever get in trouble, you can ask a couple of eggs what they're doing. What, you think it's nothing? Hellman's, the egg, the yellow, the egg. They mark Hellman's on it. Or mayonnaise. Mayan, mayonnaise, mayonnaise, nays, no, yays is to fool around and not take anything seriously. The Mayan were a bunch of jokers because they didn't have this BS that we had. So they were always jumping up and, and this and that and because they were who we are except they weren't the same as us. And they're not the only group on this earth that's like that. You see, I wouldn't know any other group. This is only a book, I told you. Nothing is real. For me, this is fun. For me, this is just a another day. But for me and I, as I is who I am and I is he, it's very important for the mind. So by doing this, it's good for the mind and I like what I'm doing and I believe what I think. And I know I'm off in a few places, but you know what? I'm not here to be corrected uh, in a test. If somebody wants to say anything, say it. Say anything you want. But you know what? It's time to pass the word. I can show you all the numbers and read them to you and repeat them and repeat them. But if you don't want to learn, what are we learning? Because it's numbers and it's colors and it's this. We don't want to know. So you know what? I'm not telling people all the numbers I used to tell them. Now I'm just telling the story that goes with the numbers. First I had to learn the numbers. Now I have to know the story. Then I'll have to learn the numbers. And then I'll have to do the story. And this is pretty cool. I'm going up and down on a seesaw. 7286 NGC 7286. Pegasus, Aquarius. Check it out, man. That's where our parking lot is. Wherever that is, that NGC, that's a parking lot of transmission of everything we're doing in this world. And it's inside of where we are. And you know what I can't wait for? The next full moon and February. Because in February, do you remember Elenin that came in? But no, everybody left it alone. It's not over yet. She has a tail like all cats. All tails right, are a shimmering light because it's the communication. They mentioned that when Jesus was born, it was a shimmering light at the Big Bang because they had to move space away because they had to move air space away for the water world. So they went from the Aries to the water world because they moved space on the Big Bang and it all began right there, right? Thank you very much, um, Einstein. You are brilliant. Brilliant. Is that who, who discovered it? Was it Einstein or was it uh, Freud? No, no, not Freud. Einstein. Who made the Big Bang? Who was that? Freud, Einstein, anyways, whatever. A nine, a Stein, a nine, eleven. Einstein is a Lenin. Okay, Einstein is not Einstein. It's a Lenin. 
Okay, so let me finish the tale. So she comes in on the other side of the sun where Mercury and Venus are, A and B. Okay, and A is across from who? The in between. If the in between is Earth, okay, that would be one skip one. But you can't skip into Jupiter, so you have to skip over Jupiter. So you skip onto Jupiter, okay, and then you skip over Jupiter. So that would be Uranus. So we're in parallel to Uranus right now because we are three and Uranus is seven. Three and four makes seven. And let me see the dice now. I turn over the dice. Yeah, three and four are opposite. Yeah, okay. We're being controlled, okay, by Uranus. And never leave out Pluto. So what was I getting to? So yes, so Mercury and Venus were on the other side. So they passed, he passed right by Lenin and then Mercury and Venus picked up the information because they have no moons. So that was a transport. They only use the sun. When they want to do something, they throw it out in the sun and then it comes to us. Okay, so they went through a Lenin to pick up that information in February 14th. Okay, I don't know if it's a full moon. Okay, but February 14th, we run into that tail where a Lenin came in on the other side. And if you think the sand has stopped, is that the way it works? What do you think? It just went on by and it fell down? It doesn't work like that up there. There is no fall down. The fall is the autumn. The autonom, you have to understand the itany, the itany. You have to understand the Indian, the inside of us. Indian, in the end, inside of us, of who we are. The colors of all, whatever they did, and I looked up a lot of their stuff. It's fantastic. So anyways, in February, we come into that tale. And not only that, but February 14th is the 45th day of the year. If you add up 1 to 9 of your birth, 1 being 1 and 9 being 9 and count other numbers, that's 45. Fox 45. Is that a TV station? That's the number of the fox. It's us. The fox and the wolf. The bear, bull and the bear. You see, even these balls in our head, they got other balls. They got eight other balls each. Everybody's got, everybody has a Ten Commandment. Everybody has a Ten Commandment. They didn't give it out to one. They gave out the rules to everybody. Everybody has to play by the rules. And if you can play by the rules, okay, because God has a choice. He can either keep you or let your ranch you come and get you. Spanish train, okay, what comes around goes around. Spanish train, you have to pass all the way back because you didn't pass. You didn't pass the computer system and God has to pray for you. No, let my son come in because it, it cost him a lot of time to get you that one little thing. And your ranch says, but he's going to disbalance everybody. So God has to pray for you. Now, how does God pray for you? The first part of God is the beta God that does the prayer. It's a machine. She knows everything that you've ever done in your life, and she can actually talk to the other machine and explain why. Because the other machine is a gray machine and can never figure out anything until it's explained. It takes one side and one side only. It looks at the rules and it says, all these rules were broken, your chakras are not right, and you're, uh, you're, not dependent. you're not independent on your own mind. We cannot let you go out again. You're going to ruin the next session. But this next session that comes out is going to be a bull session because it's not the same thing. The bulls will run the streets. The access okay, of this planet is all used up because of who we are. And the earth must turn. I'm only repeating what the Mayans say, but I'm repeating it the way I see it. The axis, okay, the axis is the exit or the exodus is on the axis of the earth because it's the axis of the access or the excess of everything, so it must shift. So the glacier breaks, Titanic is alive 100 years. Independence at 235, but minus 16 years. 222 and three more years. So we're at 219, and 219 is 38. S and S, spirit and soul, time to rearrange. The time has stopped, my friend, but it hasn't stopped tonight. It stopped over 10 years ago. But the session of explanation goes to 2010 of October 10th. And after that, you must match the four corners of your phone. 1973. 1973 added together equals 20, which is the 1010 10 commandments of God. 1010. 10. You see, because in this world, it's 10, T, 20, T, 30, T. Tick, tack, toe. Tick to here, tack to there, toe to here, up to here, out to there, connect the dots, move the things, pipes and wires. Let's go play Mario Brothers and go out for a beer. You don't think they wanted us to have beer? Because a beer is a bear, and if the bear in the cupboard is bare, it means your mind is empty. 
But anyways, for now, uh, February 14th, we run into the tale of a Lenin. I do not know what any of this means. I only can read it, but I do not know of anything to do with a result because results are all up to the gods. I am only a storyteller. I do not know any more than the story I tell. So to leave you with that picture, okay, this picture here, okay, don't you see it on top, the hat? Here's a lady, number two, beta, okay? Look at this side, there's an eye here. You see the animal here? And there's a guy without an eye over here. Got an eye on this side and no eye on this side. Tav, tav. In the Hebrew religion, they call this tav, tav. And you got another tav again. But what I'm gonna do it this way, what this is, okay? If you take a look, I put these lines because the passage was all here in the number five. The five doesn't exist anymore. So this comes out, and if you really look at it, it's a, it's a jack. And it's a part of the cross. One side of the cross, but the other side of the cross, where one is, one and four are missing. Because one and four created this passage here into this, earth, into this earth. This is the jail we're in. So T and J, Thomas Jack, TJ, okay. T is the 20th letter, J is the 10th. 1020, 1010 world. 1020 equals 30, we got the three worlds. So we're going to leave you at that right now. Wow, 51 minutes, never even paid attention. And I'm going to wash up a little bit, have a bite to eat, and I'll be back on very shortly. Um, please be the friend. But be the friend. Be your own friend. Be your friend. And if it means being friends and you believe in yourself and you believe in anything that the verb inside of me has done to the noun of who I am, then please pass this on. This is, you know who it's for? This is for Africa, my friends. That's where my money's going. But Africa means all of those who can't, who couldn't, who are missing, that it's just like impossible because nothing's impossible. But you know what? When you're that far down, it's time to make a change now. Oprah Winfrey went, went down there. She gave 10 million. Is that a lot? Well, you know what? When you're not there, it's hard to spend your money and give another hundred million because we still don't understand the world. And she's at a certain um, area, okay, her business and stuff, that she must stay up there amongst the elite because if she doesn't stay up there, what's a couple of billion dollars in this world? She's going to just dump it all. So she must stay at the top with what she does. And her money, I'm quite sure she throws it here and there. And if she can do everything else, she would, but she doesn't want to get in trouble because all good people get in trouble because it's always too late. You did good. You did good, my son. You did good, my son. Well, what did I do? You did good, my son. I see what you did. I see it. Now, who's, look at that. You're all over Facebook. You're all over YouTube. You're all over the world. No, I'm not. I'm not over the world. I'm nowhere but at home. The words, if I take away my face, all you hear is words. And it's words that count because sticks and stones are my bones. And my name is what always harms me because it's my verb and verbs hurt. We are a noun of a name that takes the place of a verb that's inside our mind and, and dictates everything we do. And we have the choice because, oh my God, what do I do? Do you see my three fingers? The shin and the sin. Here's one ball for the shin and here's one ball for the sin. These three fingers, the three fingers outside this one, the pinky finger outside. These are the three fingers. Two, three creation of God. Why two, three? Because one is the spirit and he transferred over his work over to beta, which is another side of God because he has all the sides because otherwise he wouldn't be here. His balls are perfect. You should see the way they work. It's a ball bearing. You ever see how a ball bearing is? They throw a bunch of balls in there and they're always moving around each other, always touching, creating all the time. Just like the train track, it drives on the train and it goes to the city and it comes back. How come it doesn't generate any electricity off the tracks? They should try and do something with that. And the cars, uh, like, why can't we have the exhaust go through a radiator of some sort and cleanse it? They do it to our water with charcoal and salt and they're always cleaning the car. Carbon, oh my God, it's carbon. Carbon and charcoal? Please, what kind of world are we in? Carbon and charcoal. Things gotta be changed, things gotta be fixed. If we're gonna start playing with any oil, we better start fixing the oil in our head. I'd rather put this on and be shiny and clean than anything else. And uh, Herbie, the number of car for Herbie, you remember? 53, number of Quebec 53. And if you go back to all my cassettes, you'll see. 
Portia and Herbie, Maserati and Porsche. You see, Porsche is not as good as, the, as everybody else says. It's a one spirit, it's a beautiful car, but it cannot do what the Maserati does because the Maserati is a combination of the four and six on this earth. Okay, it's the two sides. It's the good side and the bad side, and that's why they're able to make the car a lot better, and they had a race together, and I think the Maserati beat it. And the Ferrari is made for business because it starts with F. And the Mercedes, well, the Mercedes here is the silver matrix to remind us of the ocean forever and ever. And if you ever look in there, the Mercedes, it's, uh, they've got so many designs of Mercedes that people don't see because people colored it in. It's almost like saying, let's go throw a basketball. That looks like the Mercedes sign. Anyways, merci beaucoup à tout le monde. Je m'excuse que je parle pas tellement en français. Je suis capable de parler en français et de bruit pas mal bien. Uh, car, par exemple, si je commence en français, puis il y a beaucoup de monde uh, qui est pas capable de comprendre. Il y a plusieurs du monde qui parlent anglais ici au Canada uh, présentement. Puis uh, peut-être possiblement que YouTube ou Google peut tout changer ça en français. Mais car, car, car Mais c'est bon que je parle français, que mes idées peuvent changer encore plus dans une autre réalité euh, de la vérité d'un autre. Ça passe tout par la tête. Le Dieu, ok, en principe, pour finir, il commençait les Romains, puis il a fini avec les Français anglais. Because this is a leapfrog game, and we end in the place of the eagle. Fleur de lis, ok, is man angle life. Life of the eagle is what it means. And the eagle stands for 50, cat and dog together stands for 50, okay? Uh, 50 is, is the Z and the X, X and Z together equals 50, X man in the world of God, in the heaven, X man in the heaven, 24th letter, 26th letter. So you can follow all these around, whatever I do, if you're a numerologist, you want to play with it, no problem. Um, there's a lot of cards I designed on, I was going to show you, look, do I have any pictures to go? Let me see, do I have a picture to go? Do we have a picture to go? Yeah, let me give you this picture. If you want to see really how it goes around a little bit, if you think it's confusing, does that look confusing to you? You see here in the middle, the fox? You see it? You see it? You see the two eyes? The mouth right here? All the eyes, all the oceans, all over the place. And the passages, they have to pass underneath and on by and over the top and, and it spirals and turns and there's an X in this corner and there's an X in that corner. And there's another one over here, and there's another one. This is your, this is your telephone. It's only your telephone. I drew the telephone to make that, that's all. Be well, be well, be well.